Well, I've just arrived and here it is, planted by Chuck in memory of his dear friend Ken Fletcher. And that's the tree Chuck came out here a few years ago and planted in memory of Ken. Good morning ladies and gentlemen, Peter Racy here from Fruit Park YouTube channel. We're actually out at Ken Fletcher Park this morning on the 11th of uh, July 2015 to record the naming of the Daphne Fancut Amphitheatre in amongst the uh, Tennis Precinct at Tennyson. Should be a great day. Look forward to recording it for you all. Thank you and good morning. Enumerate some of the legends, but I think if I do, I'll leave someone out. So please don't feel offended if I don't welcome you individually. But I do welcome this old bloke. Good on you, Trev. Happy birthday for next Tuesday. Amphitheatre, a much deserved honor for your service to tennis. Daff had a great tennis career, a finalist at Wimbledon doubles, along with many trophies here in Australia. Trevor and Daff and family had many years coaching children and helping tennis in Queensland. Great friendships between the Fankerts and the Labors. I was only 13 in Rockhampton when we all enjoyed tennis and tournaments together. So congratulations, Daff. Enjoy your great day. One lefty to another. Well, thank you very much indeed, uh, Peter Mears. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, good morning to you all. I just, of course, commence by acknowledging our traditional custodians. And allow me to break code protocol this morning to, uh, to acknowledge firstly, of course, uh, Daphne Bancutt and to her family. Lovely to have you, Daphne. And uh, it's a, a day that is probably long overdue today. Can I also acknowledge uh, Mr. Uh, Jeff Seney, the member for Calide, and Mrs. Seney, uh, to Councillor Nicole Johnson. I think we are expecting another couple of councillors that have probably been delayed, but I'll acknowledge them if they come a little later. Um, to the former Lord Mayor of Brisbane, Sally Ann Atkinson, uh, who has been a, a great fan of Daphne Fancut, and, uh, but I guess she was one of many. Uh, lovely to have you here this morning, Sally Ann. Can I also acknowledge Mark Bloomfield, the President, and uh, Cameron Pearson, the CEO of Tennis Queensland, to Margaret Court, to Ken and Barbara Laffey, to also other tennis greats, uh, ladies and gentlemen. Well, we're here this morning to really celebrate and to honour what has been 50 glorious years of involvement in the sport of tennis. And um, going back in time, uh, I think it's fair to say that not only was Daphne uh, a great player on the court, but also she has kept that absolute love and passion for the game right through the years to be able to bring us many other tennis greats through her coaching. And uh, uh, we thank you very, very much, Daphne, for all that you have done. Just to recount, though, a couple of the highlights. 1994, Daphne won gold medals in the Australian Masters Games, the World Masters Games, and the Asian Pacific Games. But of course, in the earlier years, 1953, the Queensland Hard Court Singles Championship, the 1956 Australian Open Singles semi-finalist, and then a finalist in the 1956 doubles at Wimbledon, and going on to take the um, the, the, the tournament for the uh, German doubles with uh, Faye Nee Muller. Can I um, say to you, Daphne, that the great contribution that you have made extends well beyond some of those big names in tennis that you've produced, like the Wendy Turnbulls and others, uh, but it is the fact that you have, right throughout your coaching career, uh, also had that ability to be able to look to those who needed a bit of a hand up and your ability and your capacity to get out there and to raise money uh, for those young people wanting to get engaged in tennis and to advance their career and also those young people with a disability that wanted to also share in the love of just getting out there and having a go. We thank you very, very much for going that extra mile um, many of you may not be aware, but even back in the days of Nudgy Orphanage, Daphne was involved in helping some of those youngsters uh, get engaged uh, in the wonderful game of tennis. And of course, Daphne became then the tennis ambassador when World Expo 88 was staged. So um, 
This morning, Daphne, we, we honour you. We thank you for what has been a lifelong contribution to the game of tennis. And I think it's very, very fitting today that we come together to be able to unveil a plaque in your honour, which we'll do soon. Thank you very much. Thank you, my lovely I think it's fitting that the only two women who've been honoured uh, in Queensland uh, with venue. Well, it's a big moment. I'd like to invite the Lord Mayor and Daphne to come forward and unveil the plaque. Officially unveil Daphne Van Cut Everything. We can't see the gorgeous Gussie Nickers, unfortunately, Daph. But we can see that wonderful left handed background.